All right, what's up everyone? Duquesne23 here, and we are back with another Fan Mail Friday. Yay. Yay. Um, sorry, this one's a little bit late, uh, but we just didn't do it on Thursday night and stuff, so we're doing it tonight. And so Friday. I'll try to upload this, you know, tonight, Friday, but if I don't, it'll be Saturday morning. You know, it'll be uploaded. But um, all right, let's go ahead and get into this. The first uh, question is by Yo Bean. I did not bring that up just to make it awkward again. So, well, now you brought it up again, so now yeah, it's awkward just again. Just stop it. Just stop it. Um, by the way, uh, do you learn? Uh, did you learn, or have you learned a second language uh, like French or something? Uh, in Singapore, we learn Chinese. No, he's saying, do you learn? In America, oh. he's apparently I was not asking, in America. I thought he meant like, did yeah. you learn? Like, have I, you know, in the yeah. past learned a second language? Apparently, lane. he's in Singapore. Um, in Singapore, you know, we learn Chinese, but I hate learning any language, so yeah. Um, okay, we'll answer that one. We're required in high school to go through like learn something another most language. Most people learn Spanish. Spanish because that's the most prominent. We're in Texas, you know, so like, those yeah. are like the two main languages well, just here. Just anywhere English here in the Spanish. U.S., well, yeah. you know, it'll be. But, Spanish but I mean, a, they we had like French classes. Yeah. And, I mean, I didn't yeah. take that. I yeah. took Spanish, and we yeah. I took Spanish, and we had to take a language in college too. And I didn't. Oh, then maybe we didn't have to. Maybe I just wanted to. Maybe what I just took that as my elective. It's good to understand what people are saying around yeah, you. We I don't live really in care Texas. Uh, the I majority live in, we live in Houston, and the majority of people speak Spanish. Yeah, I'm in America. I speak English. Well, not everybody does. So well, it's, they come to America, it's learn good to English. Know when someone's talking they about come to you. America, learn English. English. I'm just saying. <laughs> Apparently, I don't know English because I can't even say that. Yeah. Um, are rabbits or dogs scarier? Dogs. Scarier. Scarier. Yeah. Dogs. That's an awkward. When are like, rabbits ever scarier? You know, Minecraft, the new update to Minecraft that just came out like mm -hmm. this week uh, on PC, there is rabbits that were added to it. So now mm -hmm. you can eat rabbits, like kill them and eat them and stuff. I love and, rabbits. Uh, but there's like a 1 in 100,000 chance that you get a rabid rabbit. Mm -hmm. And it's like white with red eyes and it starts attacking everything. We used to wait, raise so. rabbits. And actually, we have a wild rabbit right now that lives in Two. our yard under the pear tree. It comes uh, if, and eats the if pears. If the second one's still alive, well, there were we don't two. know. Uh, probably a dog killed it because we yeah. have a lot of uh, bad wild dogs around here that killed yeah. all of our sheep. So, yeah, yeah they're not good. So. But, all right, and goes, OMG, your wife is your first girlfriend. You are such a, uh, let's say, I envy you uh, for not going through the pain of breakup. That's the worst thing, being rejected or not trying. I am lucky. I am lucky. I, I wasn't going to say anything because yeah, I, I, I haven't really gone through the whole breakup thing either. Like, I dated guys, but I never was in, like, a serious She was the one who broke up with them, no, so she never well, felt bad at all. I mean, I did, but, I mean, yeah. those were, like... See, she's like, well, no, yeah. Yeah. No, but those were, like, whenever, yeah. whenever I was much younger and relationships weren't that serious, it's not like I broke someone's heart. At least I don't You never so. know. You never know. Yeah. Uh, but all right, so next one is from Blue Impulse. Uh, for Lad Duquesne, imagine you are in the Walking Dead series. Zombies are trying to uh, bash we down have your talked door. About this. Yeah, <laughs> it is a it is late at night. Of course, it's always late at night. Mm -hmm. Come on, in zombie apocalypse, you know, there's never daylight, it's always at night. Uh, and there are and they are almost in your car is in the garage, uh, but it only has enough room for one person. Uh, but there is also a school bus across the street. Uh, what? What is that? What did you have for breakfast that day? <laughs> what? That's why I was confused. I like read, read that and I was like, <laughs> "What did you have for breakfast that?" And and I was like, I was confused though. I was like, probably oatmeal. You know, really? <laughs> you well, no, just uh, well, zombie apocalypse. You never know what you have. You know. Like for to eat. Well, what if this is the very beginning of the oh, zombie apocalypse? Oh, very beginning of the zombie apocalypse. So then, this is your normal breakfast. You know, right now I have fruity pebbles over there. And and oatmeal. And oatmeal. So it depends and on what you make for Aiden. And I have eggs in the fridge. But if it's zombie apocalypse, I don't think I would take the time to you know you whip up not, some but eggs. You might not know. You know. This oh, might be the beginning the, of it. Yeah, you know, they're banging down your door. Well, so. well, some people that's how they found out about it. Hmm. Is whenever the first guy attacked. 
Hmm, I don't know. This is a very strange question. I thought you were gonna ask, I know. I what was, would you do, or something the, like that? Yeah, you you really really let down of a question yeah. there, Blue. Really let down. That that was a huge let down there. Yeah. Um, we have many sharp objects in our house, many blunt objects, and and some firearms. So I think we can. Uh, yeah. We can make it to that school bus. Yeah. We make it happen. Yeah. We go to yeah. We'd probably just go to the school bus and stuff. And the deal is this, zombies. This is what, depending what on do. what zombies this is what though, bothers we have. us about some zombie movies because people like open the door fully. It's like no, open the door just one at a time. Crack and stab, and then one you know shut the door. And if more than one of them are there, just stab, stab, stab. It doesn't stab, take long to stab you know? a zombie in the brain. No, it doesn't take it doesn't long. take that long at all. And actually, The Walking Dead they did do that with that school bus. They were inside the school bus. Remember that one yeah. episode. He was stuck in the school bus, and there was like a horde of them outside the door, and that's what he did. He would just barely crack it and just started yeah. taking them out. That's what you would have to do. Yeah, you can't let them all in. And the deal is, it also depends on what zombie. Like, I don't know what car requires only mm, one person, yeah. though. You know, what car? It, it doesn't matter what car it is. We would, we'd make it work. You could make it work. You know, we would have, like, I'd be Unless sitting like down. I'd be sitting down. Have some we'd still make we'd it make work. It work yeah. You know, we'd still make it work. Some I person, don't know. I think I'd be, rather go through the front door and get the school bus than try to do it on a oh, motorcycle. motorcycle. Yeah. I wouldn't want to be well, exposed. Well, I don't know. Unless unless you know it's a, it's a straight shot. I would want to be able to run clear, over a zombie. Unless it's a clear shot, though. Like, yeah. you're, you know for sure you'll get out if you hop on the motorcycle. Yeah. You know, uh, but the deal is with the motorcycle, man, just hop on. You know, one person could sit on the handlebars well, like a bike would over do. To the bus. You know, yeah. You know, I'd and stuff like that. I'd well, yeah, that but bus. I'm just saying that the bus is <laughs> surrounded by zombies or something. Well, yeah. The motorcycle is a clean okay. getaway. But um, we, we the deal is, it also depends on what zombies you have. Woody Pebbles if it's, or oatmeal. If it's or Walking eggs. Dead zombies, <laughs> then it's fairly simple because they're not very fast. No. You know, at all. If it's um, World War Z zombies, we don't have War a chance. War Z zombies, you might as well just die. <laughs> um, and then, or actually, no, you get sick, and then they just pass you up. With yeah, the but World how do you Z make zombies. yourself sick? Uh, I don't know. The... Start eating your poop or something. I don't know. Uh, hey, I would do it if in order to survive. You know, come on, you would too. Yeah, but he said they're Don't almost in your house. It, you, you would just eat your poop and then end up dying. It'd well, be a horrible death. Well, <laughs> and just make your death that much worse. Yeah, that's true. No, I don't know. That that'd be. Yeah, what well, was he? You can't beat those. Yeah. And then, um, but if it was sick. Walking Dead zombies, still kind of they still kind of jog a little mm -hmm. bit. They still kind of yeah, pick up you. speed. Now, if it was Shaun of the Dead zombies, that oh, would be the be greatest golden. zombie apocalypse be ever because you can just run through them and they can't really grab you too well, and you just run through them. Yeah, That's all you have to do. And you can walk around and just go. Uh, yeah, they're idiots. And apparently, you know, the, the zombies are okay with that. You know, that's what we but need. Anyway, if we have a zombie apocalypse, we need to have Shaun of the Dead zombies. But we're not a zombie apocalypse at all. You know. So, uh, so the question was your breakfast. I think we fully yeah, answered, we answered that, that and we'll be on. So, okay. So, for La Ladette uh, Duquesne, uh, do you think it is possible for you to hide all Oreos from Duquesne? And if he has one, uh, he has to wait one extra day to play the Master Chief Collection. But we don't have any Oreos. We don't buy them that often. We don't buy them that often. Not I love all. Oreos, but the reason why we don't buy them is because I eat them within a day. Yeah. You know, we, and so I don't, I don't buy them that often. When was the last often. time we bought Oreos? It's probably been at least a couple <sighs> months. Yeah, because of that reason. I finish them in a day. And that's like, what, a $4 pack of cookies, yeah, you know, wasted them. in one day. And then I feel fat afterwards, although it tastes great, so I'm okay. And, but it's just. He's not as bad as you think. <laughs> we don't. You know. We, yeah, we I don't, don't buy. I don't constantly buy cookies. Yeah. Every every now and then we buy a pack of Oreos or a pack of the Chips Ahoy Chewy. Yeah, because I love those. Yeah, but not very often. Yeah. So, but all right. And then he says for Vroom Vroom Aiden Elephant. Uh, so I'm sure Aiden would have done his thing. But I'm sorry, we're not going to film Aiden just because we're trying to get this out quick and stuff. Um, but okay, so Captain Carlio, he asked, uh, did either of you two uh, ever participate in high school plays or musicals? I do both, and I'm in a barbershop quartet. Oh, I wow. sing bass. Oh, that's pretty cool. Nice. Um, also, I'd like to give a shout out to my friend's YouTube channel. Everyone go check out The Vortex. Uh, they do gaming things, WWE, and it's funny. Disclaimer, they do use adult language. I will not allow that shout out. <laughs> Even though you just shouted yeah, it out. was a joke, Jennifer. Yeah. Way to just way to just. Um, <laughs> uh, what was the question? 
I'm trying to remember now. Do we do musicals or oh, no. you know stuff like that? No, no. We never did plays or musicals or anything like that. that kind yeah, of stuff. me too. And I and I, I can't too shy and I to, can't sing. Yeah. So. I mean, I mean, not well. I mean, <laughs> I can sing. Everyone could sing. And not well. Yeah, but Aiden, if y'all haven't seen Aiden's singing video of the Halo theme, go check that out. He can sing. And no, he doesn't just sit around listening to Halo I all the time. I know. Some people. Gosh. That boy loves everything. Yeah, he loves I books. Probably, he loves music. I probably only like played the um, Halo theme because that's like the original. Anytime I really play Halo a lot of times. He didn't pick it up from hearing it. He picked it up from you doing it. Cause well, yeah, because you would just I randomly would just do be that randomly, in the car. I, I would just randomly something. and I'd just be like, oh, yeah. ho, 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 and he stuff. And so he you. picked that up and everything. I, and I tell him it's from Halo, kids so mimic. he knows. That's yeah. what kids do. And also, Aiden, just I listen riding, to it on the computer. Just from riding in the car, whenever we ride back and forth, he repeats certain things from songs that, that he yeah. hears. Yeah. Like you know? he'll just yeah he'll be just repeating everything. That's why you got to also be careful with kids. That's why more console is not allowed to be around Aiden ever, <laughs> uh, because of that reason. Yeah. Uh, so. Watch the foul language around yeah, the children. Seriously. They are like parrots. Um. All right. So next question is from Corey. Are you a procrastinator? Yes. Yes. Very much so. Both of us. I have always been one, and will yeah. always be one. Yeah. Very I much. Just, that's my personality. That's the that's one reason why sometimes like uh, my Halo anniversary campaigns have been late because I procrastinated rendering it out on the computer, and so then I'm rendering it out at like two in the morning, you know, and stuff, and then I don't have time to like upload it because it takes like two hours to render render a fifty minute video of 1080p yeah. and stuff, and so I, I procrastinate with that stuff a lot. Now I don't so. do that like with work because that's different. But like with school, I, I was always a procrastinator with school. Like whenever we had a report due or we had a paper. And yet she still I mean, made all A's in college. There were there were so many times I waited till like the night before to write a five page paper or something, yeah. and I would just stay up all night long working on it. But I actually think I did better because of that, because the pressure like made me I don't actually know doing, I don't like know. concentrate more. I was a like, procrastinator. If, if I anytime I tried to do it like ahead of time, because I would try, but I just couldn't focus on it, and so it w- it wouldn't be as good. Yeah. And so I would wait until I had the pressure on. Yeah. Some people work better under pressure. Yeah. Under pressure. Yeah. Doom, 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 doom. And that's um, Queen and not Ice Ice Baby. <laughs> so just throwing that out there. Uh, all y'all people that don't know Queen. So. Uh, are, are there people that don't know Queen? There are surprisingly people that don't know Queen. And they should. YouTube. Like, seriously, just, yeah, go on YouTube. Watch everything Queen. Uh, if you're if you're in the middle of watching, you should have grown stuff, up with Queen. You know, you should you should watch all of their stuff because their songs are amazing. Um, and then or listen if you just Bohemian go on iTunes. Bohemian Rhapsody. You're and, telling me there's people yeah. who have never heard Bohemian. But then Rhapsody? after Queen, then you know another one that you have to know is Journey. Journey yeah. is a must. You know, on everything. Everybody so. knows Journey. I told oh, you, man. Right, you they don't might know not about know, these kids nowadays. The you don't know about these kids nowadays. They might not nowadays. know the names of the bands, but if somebody hears Bohemian Rhapsody, or We Are We Are, uh, we are the, champions. the Champions, or yeah. uh, or Don't Stop Believing. I mean, everybody recognizes yeah. those songs when they Way hear them. Way to mix in different things. Well, yeah. That was the first mixed in between. Were queen, yeah. Last one, Journey. <laughs> so people are confused. Okay. Uh, but yeah, you don't ever know Why about these kids. Why are we talking kids. about Queen? I don't know, because I did the under pressure thing. Okay. And, it, you know, you don't know about these kids, though, nowadays, that they don't, they don't necessarily grow up listening to that. Mm-hmm. So they need to know the good stuff. Okay, next. So, all right. Next one is Dan the Dino. Uh... Uh, they're saying if a guy breaks a promise, you promise you have every right ha- to kick him. Have every right to kick him, kick him in the crotch three times. That's all he said. Yeah. Well, that was not a question. I'm confused. What What was he supposed what, to be what like? Promise. What, well, I don't know. I'm saying, what is he supposed to be like? What's he responding to? Yeah. They're saying who's there. They're saying who's there. You gotta remember, this is a week later. If it's something we talked about in the deal, you gotta like remind us on here or something. Uh, I don't know, yeah, I don't but know. that is the last question on here, though. I don't think I would uh, ever kick you in the crotch. No, that's mean. No matter what you did, that's mean. I mean, you could do women things, don't, I don't realize think I would do how that. like the type of pain that is. Now, don't get me started. There's some because we had a talk with uh, 
like you know one of our friends and stuff and we're because she did she has done that to her husband and stuff and it, not that hard not like that no but like she still you know popped him like did a little pop like that or something and stuff and it, it's you know we're saying that hurts really bad and i was like y'all don't realize like how that feels and stuff and she was all like oh yeah dude i've had like three kids blah blah blah, blah. and i was like it's a different type of pain than having kids you know, like it's it's weird. Does that it's, mean it's a worse it's, pain? No, I'm not saying it's a worse pain. It's different. It's very strange pain because like you get hit there and you it doesn't hurt at first. Like you're you're okay unless you get kicked. Like if you just get like popped or something there, you know, it, it, it's at first it doesn't necessarily like hurt, but then all of a sudden this like it's hard to explain. Like this sharp pain just starts coming through, but it's not really like. It's not really like pain, like if someone pinches you or punches you or something like that. Then like, are you sure it's not a dull pain? You know, no, no. It's it's a sharp pain because it comes. Through, it's a different type of pain, but it's very strange though because then it lasts forever and there's nothing you could do to like ease the pain. You oh, can't. There's nothing you can do to ease the pain when you got something coming out of you the size of a watermelon. No, yeah. What? You can not unless the pain you, unless afterwards. You get an epidural. Well, yeah, not the pain afterwards because you know, like you're still gonna have pain and stuff. But I'm just saying, as it's coming out of you, you get an epidural and you don't really feel anything. Not at, well, you, you know. can't get an, if, if it's coming out of you. Well, it's I know, too late but you had an epidural, and not because of that. No, not because of the pain. She was gonna but, go all no, natural, okay, but, anyway. but she wasn't able to because of complications. Yeah. And so, um, and. But that, yeah, like, you didn't actually have the pain while you're having the baby and stuff. Now, I'm not saying having a baby it isn't still, painful. It was still work. I know. I know. I'm yeah. not saying having a baby isn't painful. I know it's it's probably way worse of a pain, you know, like, than anything a I guy mean, can have. does make a big You know, difference. besides getting a leg cut off or something, you know, or whatever. Uh, because it was really weird because I was laying on one side. And it's like, it's like I could almost tell the medicine was seeping to one side of my body because this side of my body started hurting really bad, like all the way down my body. Yeah. And so, you know, I told the nurse, I said, okay, it's not, it's not working over here. I'm, you know, there's a lot of pain. Yeah. I mean, which I was fine with pain because I was planning on having the pain to begin with. But since I had took the epidural, I mean, I let them stick a needle in me. So it's like, okay, it should Ooh, be working. That epidural it sticks a needle in into your back. spine. It's like, it, you know, it, I mean, if, if I allowed you to do that, then this should not hurt, you know? Yeah. And and she had me roll over to the other side, and it was crazy. It's like the medicine drained to the other side and yeah. it made the other side numb. It was really weird. Mm hmm. Yeah. But I'm just saying, I did though, not want that to get getting hit down away. there is extremely painful. And it's a very unique pain. It's not like any other pain that, like, it's not like getting cut. It's not like anything like that. You know, it's a very unique. It's very awkward. It's hard to explain. Uh, but then, of course, well, I don't understand. I don't understand why people. I don't understand why people, though, would hit their husbands or anything like that or boyfriends in the crotch because you're supposed to cherish. It. Well, yeah, that's <laughs> that, well, really. It's like that's supposed to be like, especially husbands and stuff, because you could possibly be having kids with that person. You don't want to mess something up, you yeah. know, where you, that it screws. It's you a know. free vasectomy. I mean, come on. Yeah, you know, oh, <laughs> I'd rather get a vasectomy and get hit oh, there. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. Um, but yeah, so all right, guys. Um, I guess that'll be it. What was a that, lovely ending topic. Know, yeah, that was the last one. Yeah. Well, how do we end on um, that? You're gonna have to explain that to us. Yeah. In the comments or yeah, something. I don't know. But um, yeah. And guys, I'm gonna be changing this. I'm gonna be putting the uh, um, the questions now on Forge Channel, uh, like your submission videos and on to Forge uh, submission videos. Sum, like, if you want to submit a question, go to Forge Channel. There will be a link in the description going to that uh, forum. Uh, the reason why it's uh, don't think I'm like stopping with gaming probe. I'm not and stuff. It's just that Forge Channel is originally what I've always wanted, and you can also tell I'm a Forge person. And so naturally, uh, I know people ask a lot of questions here about Mass Chief Collection, especially as it's going to be coming out. Like people will be asking questions, and so I kind of want to have that, you know, on Forge yeah, Channel. The gaming probe is about you gaming. Know. Well, I know, but Forge Channel is something that I've always wanted though because it the the way Forge Channel is set up, it's actually where people can submit and you have the preview thumbnails and you have the download link type of things. Yeah, but you don't need that for questions. Everything. I know, but that's, geez. <laughs> I just want it on Forge Channel okay. because that's originally what I wanted as a website and stuff. And Gaming Probes is a multi, you know, deal website, like it had multi like console and stuff like that. Um, but pretty much everyone, they either ask us a 
a question out off of random, like, what do we like to eat? Or they ask us something most likely about Halo. You know, every once in a while, I guess Destiny, now that Destiny's going to come out, they're probably going to say something about that. But the deal is, though, I don't know. It's just, I'd rather it be on Forge Channel and stuff. So, uh, go, you know, link in the description to that. Also, if you want to sign up for Forge Channel, please submit maps. We've had some people submit maps, like Tastic. He submitted tons of maps on there. Um, but, yeah, submit maps and everything. And uh, so your maps can get out there. We try to showcase in every single map. Um, if it's not on my channel, just at least try to like tweet out about it saying, hey, this person just submitted a pretty awesome map. Go check it out. Uh, it's to help out all these smaller people and everything so they can get a little bit bigger, a little bit more known in the community for forging. And so... Did you do um, a Loot Crate giveaway yet? Uh, we haven't done a giveaway. It actually just closed. Oh, okay. Uh, so I have to so, go see who won. Okay, because I was going to say and everything. people can apply, so, but never mind. Nope. It's already no closed. More, no more entering. Yep. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this, and we'll see y'all next time. Later. Bye. Oh, wait. Oh. Not yet. Um, since I'm done with the Halo anniversary uh, campaign walkthrough now, uh, I got to be doing Halo 2 anniversary. Someone brought up a great idea. Mm -hmm. um, I think it was Cray Spartan. Um, brought up a great idea. You should join in on at least a few of the episodes of Halo 2 anniversary campaign. The campaign. Or Halo, not Halo 2 anniversary, but Halo 2 campaign. Yeah, you should join on a few of those. You sure you want me to do that? It'll be stressful, <laughs> but I guess it'll be okay. You'll get frustrated. Jennifer, just stay behind. Stay behind. Yeah. You'll just stay get behind. killed. Just let me shoot let everything, me, Jennifer. Yeah, let me kill them all before you come out. Yeah. Don't worry. We play on, you know, like normal. Hey, I do much better against grunts and, uh, and brutes than I do against uh, real people <laughs> in multiplayer. Yeah. I do, don't I? Well, yeah, because I I they have a set path of going straight towards you. <laughs> like if it's like the flood of running towards oh, yeah. you or something like that. Or they just stand out in the open. Or they just stand out in the open like this, like pew, 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 well, pew. Well, in a grunt, you can just go, you know, yeah. just go pop them in the back of what the is that? What does that necessarily mean, that like you necessarily melee. mean okay that, that's melee because it, it, the same sound this is not me shooting the him. same the same sound though happens whenever you headshot them. Th this is not they how have I that shoot. little pop noise yeah. you know i don't know how you shoot you know is it, there's a lot of times you're like this <laughs> <laughs> so that that could be how you shoot i'm just saying i'm just saying i'm not that bad i know but I'm not that fine. good either. Yeah, but you can also expect once Destiny comes out a another um, wife attempts for the Destiny multiplayer. Because, yeah, you're going to do terrible in that. Oh, thanks. No problem. You got a lot of confidence uh, in you. It, it's similar to Halo, but it's, of course, multiplayer. But then also you have all the, like, powers and stuff, mm -hmm. too, and everything. So that's what I'm saying. And you die a lot quicker in, than in Halo. Yeah. So, hmm. yeah. That would be interesting. Here we go. <laughs> uh, but yeah guys all right thanks for watching and now we will see y'all next time see you next week bye bye